There we go. All right, we are live, boys and girls. We live. I thought I won't get no phone calls in the middle of this tonight. There we go. Slide that thing over a little bit like that. I thought I won't get no phone calls. Oops. I'm going to this. Man, welcome to the stream there, Tom. Yeah. Hey, thanks for having me. <laughs> <laughs> You crazy. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. I know. I know. All right. Let's see. Let me get these things out of here. There's Susanna. Hello. Good to see you. Hello, Susanna. Cyclonic Silver is in the house. Hello, Clinton. What do you mean? Uh huh. Uh huh. You wanna? You wanna? You can come on up here too, but all you gotta do is put a, a a one in there, buddy. Just put a one in there. You can. I'll send you the link right now. You come on up here and join us. Put a one. Put a one. It's okay. You can do it. He's scared. Tell him, Cliff. Tell him. Is he afraid? That's right. Don't be afraid. Hey, lift up your tray and show him. Don't be a... <laughs> That's funny. Sticker stinking makes me laugh, man. What's up, Clinton? Man, my thing will not say live. I swear our internet sucks up here. All right, Clint. Yeah. I'll send you the link right now then. Probably to kick me out of here, but that's all right. I'll send it to you right now. Hold on a second, buddy. I, I just needed to measure the feet. Size, size 13. I was over there looking for it yesterday, remember? I pulled this. I was on the floor last night. I pulled this all out. It's sitting on top of a shot glass, which I would never do because of the cat. Amanda? The possibility. Guess what's found? <laughs> found Cindy's nice. story. Let me see it. I want to see that one compared to mine. Oh, it's got a shorter neck. Yeah, it's a stubby. Yeah. <laughs> Cute little shit. Yeah, I attached. I did like the shells attached differently and stuff too. So. Yep. It's just stubby. <laughs> Damn, I'm having a hard time getting that cowboy off, off your turtle there, off Cecil. He rides them all day long. I'm not going to talk about that anymore, Todd. Yeah. Uh -huh. Damn, this thing is still boot, trying to boot up. That's the boss, yes. Glad that's Cindy. Say hey, hi, Clinton. So you're gonna need it, and then I can put it back where it really belongs. Yeah, give me one second. I just want to make sure I got the right. Take your time. Bring it on tonight. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's the one. That's the one. <laughs> He says, hi, Clinton. Hi, Clinton. Hello, Brian. How you doing tonight? Hey, Brian.
Hey, Brian. All right. Okay, Wilson. <laughs> so whenever you're ready, buddy. He won't come up. All right, Brian. No worries. Let's see chat again, man. Better get ready. Oh, can you can you get to work on a silent Dremel? Yeah, you want to see a silent Dremel? <laughs> huh? No, I'm serious. You want to see a silent Dremel? Put yourself right on mute. No, right here. You put your Dremel, put your Dremel in, a, in like a shoebox or something, right? Turn it on, and you use one of these. Yeah, I got one of those uh, shafts. I never got it to work on my Dremel, though. My uh, my Dremel, the brush brushes burned out. I haven't been able to afford the brushes. So. I got them on my list. <laughs> hey, Zed. How you doing? Hey, buddy? Zed's place. How you doing tonight? This is my... I like that thing, too. That makes me laugh also. <laughs> Zed. As soon as my Dremel is got new brushes in it, I'll be using this. Put the yeah, put the Dremel in like a shoe box. Don't don't wrap it in a towel or anything because it'll it'll catch fire. Well, it's those, got brush, breathe. those brushes, you're right. Those brushes that you burned up in yours are burning up because you're holding the hand over the vents. My bro, my night burnt up. Who's, who's oh, burnt? talking about Clinton? Oh, Clinton. oh yeah, Clinton's. So I got three Dremel sitting right here. I I did the same thing. I held my hand over the vents and smoked my uh my brushes. I got a cordless Dremel too, but I can't find the damn charger. That was in the box with the um, the other stuff I lost. It's in the charger. <sighs> Knew I could count on you. <laughs> no one count on me. I don't know. Larry counts on you pretty natural good. Natural born fuck up. That's not true. I don't care what I don't care what Todd <clears throat> says about you on the driveway. That's for sure. Todd does pretty good from the driveway. That's right. He does. Well, that's good. Pretty causes trouble out there too on the weekends. That's why Cliff stopped coming over. <laughs> only on only on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, Cliff stops by now. Todd was the reason behind the Y two K scare. <laughs> what? <laughs> that was that was like twenty four years ago, Todd. Way to do it, buddy. Oh, sorry. Way to keep everybody on their toes. I'm just catching up. I made a silver one. <laughs> Zed? Yeah. Went to, went to the store, bought, bought a, a metal one, and casted that damn thing. No, I didn't work or nothing. It was just a solid piece, but... Yeah, yeah. All right, let's see. We need this one right here. 
Hey, Clinton, I'm going to watch this, buddy. I'm going to run both these vents down the bottom and use one hole right here in the center. Hello, Victoria. Nice to see you. Well, hello, Victoria. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. To you. Happy, birthday. Happy birthday, dear Victoria. Happy birthday, Happy birthday to, you. to you. Man, that was extra rad birthday, boys. Victoria's gonna get me drunk tonight. Oh, awesome. <laughs> oh, they're gonna hate us. I said happy birthday to nine four nines earlier. You said I must be around 185 years old by now. <laughs> <laughs> That's like you're aging well. <laughs> Zed's place is pouring aluminum on Wednesday. Nice, Zed. You gonna do it live? <clears throat> well, this is looking a little different than I want it to look, but I know some people's minds are a little backwards. So. Hey, Brian. Little Brian Hooper. Brother Brian nice Hooper. Look, Glenn. One vent. Straight down the bottom. My buddy. Hey, Victoria, you want to see something, sweetie? Here, I'm going to present myself real quick. Don't you be calling her, sweetie. <laughs> Trying to get me jealous. <laughs> Check this out, sweetie. Check this out, sweetie. Here's your foot. All finished up and sexied up. Extra rad, huh? Is that a that's a left foot? No, that's a right foot. That's a right foot. That's a right foot. Uh-huh. That's Here's the other left foot. Here's your bottle, too. I got it all finished up and sexied up too. Looks really, nice. really good. Turned out really good. Victoria is a foot, footy master. <laughs> Footsie. All the lettering. Good evening, AZ Coins. Nice to see you tonight. All the lettering <laughs> came out and everything else. It looks really good. Turned out really good. AZ, hey, how you doing, brother? I'll just call him this in Nevada, brother, because he's just across the river. That's all. We got nine extra rad people up in there. Oh. Eight with, eight with Doughboy. <laughs> yep. All right, let's see. Zed's, Zed's place would like you to show that Coke bottle again, if you could, Bradley. My man. I can do that. Hello, Siren. Nice to see you. She's lighting Hello, up Siren. the chat. Hello, Siren. Siren. 
Her birthday's on Thursday. It is. <laughs> uh -huh. Happy birthday to you. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, a little early. Never too early. That's our friend Siren you're talking about. Yeah, I know, but we like Jesse, we can't get Victoria mad at us. It's her oh. birthday. Victoria. Just like Jesse, birthday. remember? I'm sorry. You're you're right, Todd. Well, Thank well, you. Well, he needed to get it off his chest either way. Thank you for showing me the errors of my ways. Anytime, brother. Thank you. It's true. It's true. <laughs> Hello, Chris Levin. Chris Levine, how you doing, brother? Just a little wrench a little bit right here. We can tighten this up a little bit. <clears throat> Oops. Oh, next size up, I guess. Let's try this one. That is not the right size. Dang it. Nope. Fucking thing hit me right in the face. Well, don't do that. Nine extra rad people up in here still. And you don't feel bad for any of them? I feel bad for Victoria, for sure. And but Simon. only because it's her birthday, right? Well, yeah. She didn't share no dang cake with, you know, with, with Todd. That's what I was told, anyway. She said, that Todd character, you ain't getting nothing. I ain't like, getting no cake. See? Well, you should have shared some cheesecake then, shouldn't you? Hey, I tried to. Nobody showed up. Oh, don't use Adam's <sighs> excuse now, buddy. Uh -huh. I'm not falling for that. Uh -huh. Right. <laughs> I had right. to eat the whole thing myself. If they can ship a steak through the mail, brother, and an ice cream cake, you can ship some flipping cheesecake through the mail. <laughs> Just saying. Hey, happy birthday, 949. Yes, there's cake. Ask v Victoria. 949. Happy birthday, brother. Hold on, let me get this tray out of the way. I'm going to clean this little bit of Petra Bond off here. Bam. <laughs> Curiously placed. Every time I move a tray, oh yeah, buddy. Every time. <laughs> oh, that's thinking funny. Yes, indeed. Where's there's cake? <laughs> you guys got cake. <laughs> Everybody say happy birthday to everybody. <laughs> We're hella stupid. <laughs> Makes me laugh though. The <laughs> siren got him too. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> I better put my phone on the charger. This ain't gonna last very long here with Streamyards. Start sound like Todd and stuff. Hey. Cliff, is there real windy out, out of your place? Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Lost yeah I, can, I can hear the wind just a howling out there right now. Yeah, the light's been flickering. Wow. Light's been a flickering. You can turn that into a slow jam. Um... Yeah. Hello, Anna. I'm crazy. Nice to see you. Who? Who? Anna. Oh, hello, Anna. I don't see her. Anna, Anna, Anna. Well, hello. She's right Anna. above Victoria. I don't get it. I don't see him. I think skip. I don't her see her either. Well, you gotta refresh your screen then. Don't tell me what to do. Yeah, uh -huh. we're grown. Uh huh. <laughs> if, if I want to have two pieces of Victoria's cake, I'm gonna. He got oh, it. hey. Right. I got. I guess I'll have to let you. 
Nothing I can do about that. <laughs> Todd's like, well, it was good. <laughs> it was. <laughs> See? <laughs> it was hella good. I mean, it was so good I couldn't share with my boys, you know. It was... Did something happen in the chat, or is Victoria saying hey again? No, she's saying hey. Extra rad, Mr. Doughboy. Oh. And me. I already said that. My chat's just a couple seconds behind right now. That's a lot better than what it usually is, so. If I can keep mine on live. Still don't see Anna. Hello, Anna. Anna speak, Anna, speak again in chat. Why you got to yell at her? Why? Yeah, why? I mean. Hey, I, I ain't yelling at nobody. <laughs> She's not here for the abuse. I thought we just talked about this with Cliff. Wow. I'm going to the basement. I'm going to the basement. <laughs> He's putting himself out there. <laughs> he said, I got to go. I can't deal with Through this. I'll watch on the sidelines. It's unacceptable behavior. You're still on the moon, Doughboy. Hey, listen. What I do in my spare time on the weekends is my business. Uh, yeah, except for it's Monday now, so guess what? <laughs> <laughs> That, that came from from nine four nine. By the way, it's not it's not Monday on the moon. Oh, that's where you're mistaken. It's Tuesday. Tom Clinton. Oh, well, I'm like I'm gonna take Clinton's advice or word for it. Yeah, right, buddy. Talking about the moon. Oh man. That's like that feels but way different. Clinton's been on the moon since two Thursdays ago. Well, he had a <laughs> he had a round trip pass, so he said he's going to take it and use all he can. Yeah, a round trip, stay as long as he needed to. He got permission from Sandy, so it's okay. Don't, it's only thirty eight cents cents extra for for the round trip. Well, he's in the presidential suite this time, so. Oh, yeah. Uh, he upgraded this time with all those extra, extra miles he had. So, you know how that goes sometimes. Sometimes you get them extra, sometimes you don't. It's like coming to Vegas, but think. <coughs> sometimes you get the nice suite, sometimes you don't. Upgrade. <coughs> Woo. Hello, David Carlisle. Nice to see you. To see you. Dave's not here, man. Nope, he'll be back soon, though. Yep. So the cops leave. Mr. David, how you doing today, buddy? You guys ready? Got to clean off this petrobon. <laughs> Best placement for a sticker ever. <laughs> speaking, of, st speaking of stickers, man. When I was going through my garage a couple months ago when I was cleaning it all up. I was like, I know I had more stickers when I was doing my plexiglass board over here. And I guess I found them all today, though, buddy. Check that out. Nice. Yeah, I'm talking. Yeah. Dime digger. Yeah, dime digger. Every can can. Yes. Amanda, the Durbins, Miss Ida, John Wall. Oh, you do have yeah. a Durbin sticker. Yeah, that's how yeah you got a Durbin sticker. Yeah, even a Durbin sticker. I thought he was the first one. Yeah. Oh, that one over the side. Mad scientist of YouTube right there, bro. Yeah, I got, hey, I got, I got a magnet. I got one of those. Yeah. Yeah. We got a Captain Jerk. Yeah. Killer Stacker. I mean, all kinds yeah. of great stickers in here, man. Chief. Chief. Another yeah. Chief. Let's see what you got in here. Skippy the Townie. Let's see nice. What you got in here. That's Kel and Elf's cool sticker right there. And JT Coin Rings. My old one's right there. That's a name I haven't seen in a while. Kel and Elf. King's Coins. Yeah. King's Coins. Yeah, that was a good one, too, huh? Yeah. 
have probably a hundred stickers right there. I'm gonna put up now. That's hella stick and extra rad. Nice. Wheaties, bro, are you sure? I, I do like uh, grape nuts a lot better than Wheaties, so just letting you know. Captain Crunch is really good. That's my favorite. I'm just teasing, bud. I'm just teasing. I seen your text. I just forgot to look in the book and see what, you mean, uh, what you're doing. I was cleaning up these other pieces today. So I can get all that just stuff completely shipped to Madero. Wait a minute. Louder than that. Wise. Yeah. And how about? The garage, Clinton. Your garage is the size of my house. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Ten extra people up in here, though. All right, let's see here, Todd. Let's get this thing out. Say, so you put yourself on big screen when you do that. Why why he yelling at me again? We just talked about this about 15 minutes hey, ago, man. Hey. If I gotta keep yelling at you two, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might, have, I, might have, I might have to go to the basement. I was gonna say, weren't you gonna put yourself in the basement, man? Uh-huh. <laughs> I could be there in about 25 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, 35 a city is driving, right? Hello, Becky Joe. Hello, Becky Joe. Hey, Cliff, four, uh, nine, uh, four, 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 nine minus 18 says, Cliff, you need to put some uh, lip grease on that, uh, on that press to keep it from, uh, uh, from creaking, but <laughs> it's a splash, a small drop of that lip grease. When you're smiling, <laughs> give him a kiss, baby. Give him a kiss. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. ah, that's so scary. Lord mercy. Makes you laugh, though, huh? <laughs> you're only supposed to do that when 710 comes in, ain't you? For chubby hubby? Well, or, or, or by request. For sure, for sure. Well, it takes a while uh, for that grease to to kick in. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! It's starting off already, boys and girls. It's only Monday. <laughs> we run this ship twenty four hours a day. What the love boat ship? The Brad boat? A lot of cleanup still. Ain't worked on it yet, but. Yeah. Never going to guess whose birthday it is in about 15 minutes. Yep. At 5.45 in the evening, he was born. Oh, man, we got trouble in the basement, boys and girls. We got trouble in the basement. Gabby uh, Clinton. Ladies Gabby Clinton. Gabby Clinton. Clinton. Welcome to the stream. Dun, da, da, da. What's up, everyone? <laughs> What's going on, Cyclonic Silva? <laughs> I'm working on. We're playing racquetball. I'm winning three games to one right now. Hey, Doughboy. Yeah. Finally started my flex shaft. You what? Finally starting to use my flex shaft. I forgot I had it until you said that earlier. Yeah, put the thing in the drawer. Mine's brand right. in the package. Nice and quiet, right? Yep. Hello, Becky Joe. 
You got a drawer right there? Like a Oh yeah. I got plenty of drawers. Uh it's probably still wanna be noisy. I gotta get I gotta get brushes for my Did you end up getting brushes? No, I didn't get any yet. Would you just bought a new one? Or oh. did you I just stopped it from smoking. I just stopped it from smoking. Took the took the cigarettes away. Yeah. Oh, I can't hear. <sighs> it still doesn't work in the drawer. It's still fucking loud. I'm... Hey, buddy. Watch your language here. Here, seven ten. How you doing, seven ten? The cheese. Seven ten. How you doing, brother? Now I gotta wait seven and seven seven hours and ten minutes before I can show the lips again. See that? <laughs> That's seven yeah. hours and ten minutes. Buddha. 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 It's got see that little mess up right there? It's gotta get remelted. Oh I've been shot in the neck. I've shot in the head. And my <laughs> my naked chick wherever she went. She got shot in the boob right there. It's a little tiny little hole. Well, hey, Claren, do me a favor, put that away, buddy. Yeah. I bet. La, 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 la. I don't know how they feel about that. If I can't show silver art with another form, I don't, think they're gonna, I don't know how they're going to feel about another form of silver art either. You know what I'm saying? Right. I agree. I'm sorry about that. I forgot. Yeah. This turned here. out pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty badass. And I left a little scuff mark on the back. Like, you know how you get that crud and shine it all up. It's all right. It's all right. Oh, it looks good. All right. That's why they call it artwork, right? That's right. Whoa, whoa, easy there, Turbo Jackson. You call me Turbo. I was talking to myself, but then. <laughs> Man, we can yeah, bro. people up in there. Yeah, brother. Whenever I remember, I told you how the silver came out the bottom of the flask. Yeah. It poured onto the thing like this. It's like a guitar shape. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a shoe. Got a shoe horn now, buddy. <laughs> right. <laughs> It's a cyclonic shoehorn. There we go. Seven ten. When you're smiling, uh, man lips with teeth. That's just that's that's uh, right, no boy. <laughs> that's a model of the cliff right there. <laughs> Let's save enough to get plastic surgery done. Cliff got them luscious lips. Yeah. They're always dry though. <laughs> <laughs> wow. God. My lips are chapped. You bring me my lap, my chapstick? So, Bradley, how do yeah, you buddy. do the. You have the. You have a piece made. It's like a wishbone where you pour two pieces like that, don't you? Yeah, I took a piece of wood and just carved it out. And filed it down and stuff so yeah okay because yeah, i was thinking about doing something along those lines but i can't i can't make anything straight to save my life my oh, eyes, great well the, the secret is my brother is you have to use both eyes open see that's the issue that's i'm not <laughs> i'm not gonna say a single word <laughs> I'm keeping, keeping my mouth shut <laughs> yep uh, how do you too that's, that's, why there for Brother Clinton. that's why I don't have the camera facing towards me because if I did, you guys would think I'm looking at the chat and the wall at the same time. And Metallica it's wrote a song, Sleep with one eye open, <laughs> pillow tight. <laughs> I'm sorry, Clinton. Oh, it's okay. Trust me. I know. <laughs> For as long as I've known you, Doughboy, you can say it. <laughs> I, 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 uh... Now, Todd, on the other hand, <laughs> nope. I, I didn't say nothing. Todd's the nicest guy in his driveway. Right. 
So I had to fix Sandy's uh, genie today, her cab or cabbing machine. She went oh, yeah. and she put new leathers in it and put a new belt on, and the shaft went and spin. Uh oh. So I go over and I'm looking at it. I watch the video. I go back over, look at it. She put both the screws in the right place, but the one she put in sort of catty wampus, I guess you would say, is a nice way of saying it. So as soon as I fixed it, I felt like a hero because I it worked. <laughs> I just See? our hero. Well, you're our hero for sure, buddy. <laughs> you're right. That's why she calls me and when she has issues with it because she knows that I'll watch videos and research it and research it and then I'll fix it. And then she'll be like, I wanted to fix it. <laughs> well, I was going to get to that. She's going to put it on my to-do my, uh, to list. Right. Where is my Sandy at? She's on the phone. She's just talking to one of her rocking rock hound friends. Oh. Uh -huh. 710 wants to see my giant cock-a-doobledoo. Well, you're going to have to go outside and show them that. I don't know if the barn's open, but you guys ever seen that side of that chicken? That chicken is huge. You got a giant chicken there, Doughboy? I do. The big old cock. He's a, he's, he's the size of Foghorn Leghorn, man, but different. Nice. Is it red? Nope. No. Green. Green. It is. I think that chicken's a little bit off. <laughs> nah, he's from 33 nah, inches he's, long. He's from Spain. Uh yeah, definitely from Spain. Uh-huh. So like that. that chicken from the medical uh thing he's got there. Uh, yeah, for right. sure. This thing is this is small too. I think it's 2.4 ounces. I mean it's not it's not small in my hand, but it's the weight is light. No, it looks good. 2.4, that's a decent size weight right there. And I shined uh, the sword up and toned the um, the snake. So it's different. That is the shish kebab. Yeah, the shish kebab. Give me, give me a minute, uh, 710. I'll go get the... <laughs> I can't see anyone in chat, so if anyone says anything to me, I do apologize. I'm not being rude. Uh, nope. Don't let anybody say anything right now. I'm two minutes behind, though, so I can't say nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least a minute and a half, anyway. Let's see. Yeah, a minute and a half. All right, let's see. We got to tap this thing out. This is concave on the inside. Kind of, kind of hollow, so we'll see if we can get it to work. What the heck? God bless you. Bradley might need to take his pants after that. That's my spring on my. I have like a 1970s desk lamp that I that's what I use for my to hold my phone. It's inside the springs. So when you guys hear that, that's because the phone had to move the sound phone. Like, <laughs> sound like you blew a gasket. Bradley, we're all friends here. We understand. We know. Well, you can't have bullshit a bullshit. Or we bullshit. <laughs> right. We know that sound. <laughs> we know that. We've all been of, there. That's the sound We've of all trouble. had Taco Bell. That's after I eat mashed potatoes. Uh, that's that sound of trouble for sure, huh? We've all had a biscuit from McDonald's. <laughs> when you slide in the first. Bam. Something big just <laughs> out of my house. Walking up the ladder and you feel. If something. I don't say hi to Doughboy, I'm ignoring him. Ha ha ha. <laughs> well, I'd say so. As many times he wishes you a happy birthday, I mean. Yeah. It's okay. I'm used to it from him. Dang it. He's got a problem with me ever since he ran into my ex. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, he, he sent me a picture of her again today. He was he was being there another character. Yeah, he's in love. <laughs> Try to tell him about her. He'll learn. He'll learn. Well, she rips his whole bag of carrots off like that. 
<laughs> you won't trust her no more either, buddy. Day's coming soon. I see how close they've been getting lately on the last two she days. Likes, she likes all carrots. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's just wrong. It's not right, but it's not wrong at the same time. Mm -hmm. That's when we the next one. I hope this works, Todd, for your friend. Yeah, I hope so. Todd got friends? Heck yeah, he's got friends. I got a couple. They're in low places, but they're friends. <laughs> right. How can I get one? You got to sign up for that, buddy. There's a waiting, there's a waiting list. The, the commodities <laughs> trading list, yeah. <laughs> What's up, little brother? How'd your first day of uh, the working go there, buddy? Hello, Neil. Neil, Hello, Steve. Hey, Cliff, I just want to let you know that uh, 949 wants to let you know that she is a big ass, man. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Now, you can see those all over the place up here in Red Rock Canyon up here in Nevada. They, they wander wild all over the place. What's that? Wild donkeys. And horses. Donkeys. <laughs> That's what we're talking about is Chris X. Uh, did you, like did you see that there? I can't see nothing. I'm blind. I'm going to leave that one alone. <laughs> I didn't even. I wasn't that was, cool. that was nope. called the bell. I wasn't falling for it. <laughs> Shut up, bam. Knocked in town. Dang it. I love you, Clinton. It's all right. I love myself, but I get in trouble. Whoa, easy, but easy. <laughs> Relax, bro. Relax. Relax. Don't do it. How do all? Oh, he's getting. A, oh, yeah. My niece, Shyla, man. She, that little girl right there, she's got she's got man hands. She, she want to <laughs> a massage. <laughs> that girl right there, she she can paralyze you. She do that, that damn thing like Star Trek. <laughs> Done. Out for fifteen days, guaranteed. The only thing that brother. Funny is the twitch. You can still get your left leg. What you got there? Gold. I like gold. Put it in a box. Put it in your box. Sounds good. Oh, man. See that, Cliff? Todd, no argument there. How easy that was. You guys need to pay attention to that, man. It's yep. from Everybody. the Bauer Mine in Toulouse County, California. Huh. It's pretty cool, though. Oh, she's doing your feet? <laughs> I feel like it's show and tell up here. I gotta stop. It's like one of those bank pens that says stolen from. There you go, Bradley. Hold on one second, everybody. I'm just kind of in a kind of an important part. This is this is this piece is for Todd's uh, friends. I want to. So, so this is gonna be a charm that we're making right now. So. Oh man. Oh yeah, I love those knives. You're very good on. I'm going to make an actual knife soon. Oh, hey, can you take it off there? That way we talked about this, huh? Yeah. I don't, it's okay. I, don't, I, don't know okay. they, I don't know how they feel about those either, buddy. I forgot. Yeah. Man. Yeah, One of these days, I'll actually remember something. Yeah, I had to put mine away, too. But I know, I know how you feel. Yes, we do, brother. What you put away? Is is letter letter opener? Yeah. Letter opener. My eleven point one seven ounces of letter opening. <laughs> right. Oh, you. There you go, brother. There's a pour for you. 
That's badass right there. That's going to be a big one. Yeah. Well, I'm afraid to pour it. Not afraid to pour it, but if you want to sit here and collect dust. I got something. I got something for Brian Hooper. I'd love to have poured. What's that? Hold on. That's gonna be a big one too. A big Buddha. Big. Yeah. Oh yeah, that'd be a big one for sure too. Yeah, that's, that's gonna be. Good, that's a I'd good say five, six, six to ten ounces. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty cool though. It's I, I got it from a rock shop. It's a little carving, so that's pretty cool. And you know, I like pulling my Buddhas. <clears throat> oh, that's a cool little Batman one. Damn it, Joe Boy. That's why I don't play with things. Why we can't have nice things. 100% why we can't have nice things. Is Brian still in here? That's a cool pendant. Like it. You got to make it. Hi, Burger and Pie. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to do a couple things here, too. We're expecting you to pour sometimes. I'll pour when I'm damn good and ready there, pal. <laughs> there it is. There it is. <laughs> uh -oh. Here it is. Look out. Send that to okay. me, dog. I'll pour it for you. Yeah, send it to Bradley. We'll do a good job. Oh, uh, Batman. Isn't that cool? That is very yeah. cool. That was one of my first graphite builds that I did was, uh, was the Batman. Yep. One of my first engravings was the Batman. Yeah, it's in one of those boxes down on, under the shelf there. Yeah, Brian, sent, Brian Hooper sent this to me. That's Mr. Hooper to you. Super Duper, Brian Hooper. Okay, you got it right. I'm never mind. You got it. Never mind. Bye bye. I thought he was still in it. Nine four nine says uh, that's that, that that's extra cool, Wilson. Thank you. Look at this. This is terrible. <clears throat> I it's broke it. It's glass or it's stone. Uh, Gorilla Glue. Uh, Gorilla Glue gets all over the place. Not if you use very small amounts, buddy. I don't know anything about small amounts there, buddy. <laughs> you use a, a toothpick. Yeah, a toothpick use, or a, a pin. Yeah, you can use some E6000, too. I love E6000. It's stinky, though. Yeah, you can use some clear... JB Weld uh, Epoxy, too. 2,200 yeah. pounds strength. I got a bunch of that, too. E6,000. Yeah, e like you're underwater, buddy. Stuff. That's good. But, uh, Sandy doesn't have a whole bunch of that E6,000 running around? Yeah, we both, we both do. Okay, I thought you guys did. But we lost Todd. He's, uh, he was underwater. He was echoing. You found a belly tech. Awesome, Brian. Yeah, I meant to I meant to mention that, Brian. I didn't think he was still there. He did he found that. That was the tech and we were just talking about it tonight. What you making though, boy? Something special. Uh I don't know if it's special. But if everything that comes from me was special, my friend. <laughs> That's because I leaked the windows on the bus. That is 100% correct. Window, <laughs> my friend. So you're not supposed to leak the windows on the bus? No. No. Uh -huh. 
not after the bugs go I, through. I think I think my bus driver smokes on the wind smokes on the bus because the windows taste like nicotine. <laughs> oh, brother, did you? Did I show you the? Uh, Damn it! Huh? The pieces I enameled the other day. I don't remember if you did or not. Stanny and I took this enameling class. So you can, like, so I can enamel on silver and copper and stuff like that. I made these two. Oh, nice, bro. Yeah, but they're, they're like earrings. What am I going to do with earrings? Uh, put some holes in your ears and uh, wear them. Yeah, I'm not going to wear these, bro. <laughs> well, you ask me your fur. That's all. Simple answer, simple question. It's pretty cool. Little, little pieces of copper like that. The Ouch. Looked up pretty good. Oh, Todd. My bad, buddy. Sorry, Todd. Uh-huh. 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 <laughs> that was a good one. Uh, I know what that. Uh, I know what that uh, 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 means. <laughs> Hello, custom screen uh, screen printing. Hey Wayne, how you doing, buddy? That's Wayne, everybody. He does t-shirts. Yep. What's up, Wayne? Hey, yep, it's Mister Wayne. <laughs> ah. w, you know, Harbor Freight doesn't sell any presses anymore. No, I know. I think they got sued. This this one's pretty dangerous. Is that the one the spring pops out? Um, yeah. Well, I got tricks for all that stuff. Uh, um, I bolted my, I bolted my, I drilled through my um, my jack and bolted it so it yeah. doesn't, so this doesn't slide out at me. Right. I put, I put stuff in the spring so they don't see. Oh, okay. So they're they're in there. We got one of the Sandy bought one of the Bonnie Dune ones, and it's pretty cool. But I don't know. Scary, right? They're they're crazy. Like here, I'll show you. Last year, I lost. Last year on this one, I lost my whole. Seven tennis my whole whole That's unacceptable. Like this is the one that she has. Oh, that's a yeah, like a book press. Yeah. Yeah. But in order for me to, like, if this wasn't in here, if I had a piece of my silver in here, there's no way I could put a die up here to stamp. Right. I have to hold it there continuously. If, until... you, if you get, is that magnetic? Or no. Is that stainless? It's stainless. Stainless. I would figure a way. Yeah. I don't know, but she doesn't like me messing with her stuff. You you want it for uh like pressing like the um the letters and stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah. You're better off with one of these. For that. I was thinking about one of them. Now that's an arbor press. Yeah, and that one does that have the it has like the slits in the bottom too, right? What is it? It has like slits, like four slits in the bottom. Yeah, but you can, you turn that slit to an, a closed space. Okay. It's and then the force if you have to press stuff out. Yeah. Well, that's cool because I was thinking about getting one of them, but I wasn't sure how to, I wasn't sure if that moved or not. If the bottom piece moved. Here, hold on. I'll show you how. Yeah, see this? Yeah, I wasn't sure if that moved. 
Yeah, that. So you, you turn that to this empty space, and you could take this right out like that. Put a piece of plate seal in there or whatever. Right. This is just on a little pin, you know. Right. And then I, whenever I got to stamp letters into anything, um, actually, my buddy Bill. I gotta show you. I gotta show you what he printed me up on a three D printer. But I have my letters right here, the numbers. Right. These are the letters. The numbers are in the drawer. And they but, fit in there? Huh? They fit in that? Oh, yeah. Nice. That's plenty of room. There's like plenty of room for. That would make my stamping so much easier. It would. Um, let me show you what my buddy printed me up. Um. That would even like make your life a hundred times easier with with that stuff. Um, even if you were just hammering. Yeah. Hold on, let me show you. Yeah. See? Yeah, I have one of them. I have a plastic one. Yeah, this, these is three D printed. <coughs> He printed me up three different sizes for the. Yeah, see, I got this one. Hey, oh, thanks, yeah. Wayne. Yeah. Yep, thanks, hey, Brian, Wayne. Yeah, uh, Wayne, Wayne shared you out on his community tab. Yeah, I just seen that. Thanks, Wayne. Appreciate it. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, he three D printed me these three different sizes. Oh, cool. Yeah, I'm sure that I didn't even think about this. I I had this in my drawer forever, and I was like. I'm never going to use it, but that would make it much easier because now then you can see down to like with it being clear at the bottom, you it, can see you where probably, it goes. You probably have more control over that too. Yeah. With as far as you know, with silver, you're not going to have to. You don't have to put six tons of pressure. You know, you just need right. to mark it. Right. This thing, this thing will put that. This thing will put that dot, that number or letter right through the silver. You know what I'm saying? Right. Even that book, but the book one you have there would would make a mess. Yeah, because my that's where I have issues. Let me find a piece. Uh, are you trying to say you you went through a lot earlier, button? <laughs> <laughs> no, Brad. That um. Okay. Oh, you see how my stamp? See how my stamp didn't come out that well. The Abba press would you would be able to have more control, like you more feeling of right of what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Right. Um, you might even be able to. Gaming. You might even be able to go on on Craigslist or Craigslist or Marketplace and get one, you know, used. Right. For you know, maybe fifty bucks or something. Yeah, I was I was thinking about getting a sander today because I'm I'm getting really tired of doing the hand sanding and like the Dremel and stuff like that. But get yourself go to Hobbit Freight and get yourself one of those multi tools. Yeah. With, with the little triangle pads on it. Right. Twenty nine bucks. I use my I use my Dewalt drill with two inch sanding pads all the way to ten thousand grit. Yeah, well, that's what I use. I use this all the way up to ten thousand. I, I got I got the one inch like that. I got the one inch, the two inch, and the three inch. Yeah. All the way up to ten thousand, but they yep they go all the way up to fifty thousand in some cases. Yeah, I mean, but I find with ten thousand, even just doing ten up to ten thousand. Like, if you go much further than that, fingerprints are going to put scratches on the damn silver. This right. is 10,000 right here, and it's nothing but a mare. Yeah. That's 10,000 grit. With my fingerprints all over it now, of course. So. <laughs> well, that's like this one, Bradley. This one is... I did this one up to 10,000. Or I do all of them up to 10,000, but this one... Those are all little like mirrors on there now. Right. 
like this side I did. This one turned out. One of these days I'm going to have a sale because I'm, I've got so much silver sitting here that's poured and just sitting here. Yep, yeah, I'm going to too. Maybe at, the end of, maybe at the end of the month we can. Sounds like a plan to me. We can do a big auction on my channel. Me, you, and Playoff, and whoever else wants to join it. I was going to join, uh, or I was going to wait until next year. I was going to make up a bunch of pieces and then get a table at the fun show down in Orlando at the coin show. But it's like, I think, $2,300 or $2,400 for three days. For a table? Yeah. Ooh, I thought twenty bucks, I thought twenty bucks was bad for the craft fair. Yeah, but it being the fun show, this is the I think the second biggest show in the United States for coins, and I know. like two or three million people through there. But still, if I'm not if I'm not doubling my money while you know from paying for the table, what's the sense? Yeah, well, your first twenty three hundred dollars worth of sales goes to goes to the spot. Yeah. Hello, Kenneth. I can nice see you tonight. If you were selling hundred thousand dollars worth of stuff, right? Hey, Kenneth Bird. All right, brother, you got to hurry up with this porn, brother. I ain't got to do a damn thing but stay flipping looking sexy, buddy. <laughs> When's that going to start? Well, maybe after 6.15. <laughs> no problem. I can't guarantee right. you that, though. But Listen, nobody out here takes EBT, buddy. Oh, he, he fainted. I did. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> He thought everybody was on EBT. <laughs> you got any tricks for jeweler solder, Bill Boy? Tricks? Yeah. Straight. I'm tired of breaking these. Stop. Solid. Stop. Slow down. Slow down and lube. Get yourself a box of crayons. Yeah. And lube. Well, I got. This stuff, the cut loop. Yeah, I use that, but it seems like I can go through maybe three pieces, like three three saw blades, and now, I so haven't cut much at all. What do you? Are you? Damn it! Are you breaking blades, or are they going dull on you? Oh, I'm breaking them. Yeah, you gotta you you gotta slow down. You, yeah. You're trying too hard, too fast. Slow, steady strip strokes, and even even I and Bradley break the freaking things. I think the people that make them are just sitting laughing at us, knowing. No, they're no, no they, they're gonna break as soon as they start. They start getting hotter when they when they dull. Yeah. And that's when you start, they start grabbing. If you're not straight, constantly straight with the blade, you're going to break, you're going to keep breaking them. Yeah. But breaking them's part of it. It's just no, no way around it. I told Sandy, I want to stop using them and I want to start using her, uh, her Gemini trim saw that she uses her to cut her rocks. <laughs> She wasn't having it. Yeah, yeah Neil, that was very nice of Bradley, wasn't it? The the jewel saw is, is uh, really a good tool. Yeah, Todd, I'm gonna have to uh I'm gonna have to pour it with the little I can't I won't be able to use that uh that 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 ring inside here at all. So what I'll have to do is I'll pour it and uh what we'll have to do is we'll have to uh just make a i have to solder a, a ring onto it. That's the only thing I can come up with. So it's going it's to okay. pull sand. There's no way I can make a ring inside of the sand. You know what I'm saying? Right. How's that? How's that look, though? I mean, uh, all the detail and 
Thank you. Come out. Here's the inside. Oh, that would be nice. But I might have you make two of those, you know what I mean? You might not get two of those. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Come on. Okay, okay and here's here's the outside right here. I'm still put, making the, but look how good it turned out. Oh yeah, nice. So, I mean, every bit of it, it's all there. Let's see what hey. happens when we, when we pour it, though. Yeah. Hey, um, Clinton. Yeah. yeah. More than likely, I'm gonna have you do two of those, Bradley, if you would, please. Let me see how this first one turns out first, my friend. Yeah. It's you know, hard it is for me to get a, a, a ring soldered inside there, too. So I hear you. What's up, dude? What? You got your, you, you're cutting on the downstroke, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's exactly. Hello, Jack Goldman. I watched a video on it and it said, uh, I guess the easiest way for the person on the video to remember was to pet the cat and don't pet the cat. Right, yeah. the cat tongue. Yep. Yeah. Now, Bradley, that the second piece that you put on the second part that you put on the flash, the top part, Bradley, that one right there. Now, whenever you put the lines in there, do you take the line from the end of the piece into that as well as you do on the other side? I barely touched the piece. I barely touched the mold part. Okay. If I bring it down the side here, where it's deep enough to catch, I come out of it. So, because you got to remember how deep this sand is over here. So, you allow that to be on, just got to be able to check, travel underneath it. So, right. Kind of like, like a little tunnel, I guess. But. And that's where I was, that's where I ran into an issue today is I had it there. But, you know, see what you're doing right now. I did that on the other side. I took that little, um, that little lip off from where the sprue goes. I took the lip off on both sides, and my pour didn't have. I guess there was too much air getting into it from taking both sides of that little lip off from where the sprue goes, and that's why I ended up with so many pit marks in my one piece I did today. Okay, that's my story anyway. Stick to it. <laughs> yeah, you gotta stick to it at least. Yeah. Oh, uh, Jack. Are you getting all your baby mean? powder out of there too? Because baby powder will help will help cause a lot of pitting too. Too much baby powder? Yeah, if you don't get it all off of there, yeah, it'll it'll leave it. Ah. There could be the issue. Yeah. It will leave pitting, my friend. Where's my I need a golf tee. There they are. All right, fellas. Well, I got to go. Where are you going, buddy? We got to go to the store. Oh. Hi, Sandy. Jeez. Hi, Clay. Have a good night. <laughs> How you doing tonight, Jack? Later. Tell, Sandy, tell Sandy we said hello. I definitely will. Later, guys. Hey, you bloody Hi, brother. Hi, brother. Hello, flying, flying Dutchman. Good to see you tonight. Have a good one, Clinton. All right, let's see here. All right, it's looking pretty good. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, no, Jack. You got here, though, brother? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what? 
Uh-oh. Oh, we got 14 extra rad people up there, though. Yeah, we do. I broke my ankle. Don't do that. My ankle. All right. Designs everywhere. Let's vent it. <laughs> Keep all that together. Time. So we don't lose any pieces. Okay. Yeah. Claude, you want to come over and pick up some dimes? <laughs> Trade down, Cliff. What's that? Can you just spill a tray or something, or knock shit everywhere. Wow. Uh, Neil says, "Hit the button on the life alert." <laughs> I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> Here comes Larry with a defibrillator. <laughs> oh, God, shit everywhere. Son of a bitch. 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 bitch. Oh, I see it. I see it. I see it. Larry's pretty resourceful, uh, you know. That's why I haven't thrown him out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, he's, he's great on Halloween. Yeah, he's quite the hit. <laughs> All right. Well, I got the, the two flasks made now. Lord, mercy. That one, that one for Todd. I took my time on it, Todd. Everything looks... Flipping sexy, I hope it pours as good as that mold looks. Nice. Right? And we got 13 extra rad people up in here, though. All right, guys, I'm going to mute my stuff. I'm going to. Uh... 949 counts as three of them. Oh, I, think I'm, I'm, I think I presented myself. That's not right. Get Cliff over here, too, and Todd. That's not right. What's going on over there? There we go. Where the boys back there. Oh. Uh-huh. I think that was because Clinton left. I think that's, that's what happened. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Let me miss this real quick, I guess. Oh. 
Oh boy. Those things stay up here now. Oh, there she goes. Tight some of those little screws down and everything else. Done to the done. Right. The light, lights are flickering. <laughs> oh, I hope I don't lose power. Not yeah, it's true. We're supposed to have real strong winds, wind advisory in Lewiston here anyway. Larry doesn't know how to start the generator. Damn it. Uh -oh. And tomorrow is supposed to be sunshine and 48 degrees tomorrow, they said. Really? Sunny all day. Yep. I gotta mute myself. It's gonna get loud with the torch. So, I love when they push in one. One. I don't have to keep adjusting them. Nice, Wayne. Two left. Everybody's welcome here. Right, Doughboy? Yeah, for the most part. Even, even, even 949s. Well, even, though it's, even though it's his birthday and everything. We do have a limit. Yeah. The 949 rule speaks for itself. I mean, <laughs> I wonder if 867 is coming back anytime soon. Hope, hope not. That's another one that's really, really not allowed in here. Check up. No, there's a height limit, not a capacity limit. You have to be a certain height to ride the rides here. <laughs> Big shoes to fill. Seventy-eight. Geez, we won't see seventy-eight till June. All right. Hopefully June. <laughs> right. Last year it was freaking rained all year. Yep. Well, we got rain coming after later this week, Wednesday, Thursday, I believe. I'm all right with the rain. I've had enough of the snow this year. Yeah, we haven't had much here. Like it all the time. Right. He's almost melted. Almost ready to pour that baby. It was, it was snowing today. Was it? Yeah. Not here. Yeah, snowing when I was going through a lot. <laughs> Unacceptable. <clears throat> She's a hobbit. <laughs> Figures the last one's gonna fight me. Seventy eight degrees, Brian. I'm 
waiting for a nice 50 degree day. I like to do my fender. There we go. She went. She went. The wing go up. I should be done with the press now. I want to heal. My Cindy's only 411. She's a shorty. Shorty, shorty. Come on, pour that thing already. <laughs> Don't rush him, please. He yeah, says, so Brad, that don't look hot enough. Touch it to make sure. Put your tongue on it. Yeah. Lick it. <clears throat> He's Russian. <laughs> He's got Russian hands and Roman fingers. I know his parents. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We won't say anything. Ready to pour to me. There you go, yeah. See how it's bu bubbling? It's like uh, like it's got a hot beat. Yeah. Now he bumped the camera. Threw himself offline. Still there, Todd? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He froze up. Yeah, he did. Yeah. I think he bumped his phone. Could have. He melted through it. All right, nine, four nines. Well, that's nine, unacceptable. Brad, time for some, Brad down. Time for some chow. He'll be back. It is Susie. Susie's scoping out some deer. <laughs> yep. She went through a lot with me today. Oh yeah. Yeah. Where was that at? The the deer? Yeah. Just, just up the street. Really? Wow. It's usually right around sundown, right around four o'clock in the afternoon, four thirty in the afternoon. This right, yeah, maybe forty or fifty of them that gather there. The guy feeds them. 
puts corn down for them. Right. We lost Brad. Yeah, we did. Mm hmm. Right into the shining moment. There he is. <sighs> yeah. He must still have over overheated his camera uh, there. Yeah, that's probably what he did. Yeah. <laughs> the deal looked delicious. They do. Susie was sticking her head out the window going, wait until next year, guys. Uh -huh. All right, I got to find the right ones here. Yeah. That's one. Hey, Bradley's muted. Probably still trying to recover. Yeah. Oh boy. I hope he report. <laughs> Wait till you see what I got planned for this. Oh, yeah? Yabba-dabba-doo. That's about the size of a golf ball, isn't it? Uh, a little smaller. A little smaller? Yeah. Let me... Uh... Yeah, it's about the size of uh, a ping pong ball. Yep. Did you find that? Um, I picked it up somewhere. Um, I got plans for it. So, Timu. I think it was 12 cents, 30 cents, something like that. Yeah. They're not very expensive. What I'm going to... It might have even been a buck. I don't know. I don't remember. It takes a little while to get stuff from them, so... Right. Have a good night, Wayne. Thanks for coming. 
Good to see you again. Woo. Oh, Bradley's coming back. Okay. Like to see that piece. <laughs> Well, he's trying. There he is. Man, phone over here. Right. That's what I thought. Yeah, to, the, to the to the torch is too close to the phone. These iPhones over here. But I got some good pours. I can soak this one out here, though. Nice. I just did this one just now, so you guys. Bam, close pins. We close pins came out. Extra ad. Nice. Right. Yep. Well, let me show you, Todd. Your brother says it's Logan's birthday. Happy birthday, nephew. I have a good one. Custom screen. Later, Wayne. Thanks for coming, buddy. Everybody was waiting for the damn pour. Yeah. Yep. Kind of hard to pour, but my torch was close to the phone, but that's all right. All right, check this out, buddy. That looks pretty cool. Turned out real good. Nice detail. You just pull that now? Yeah. He froze up again. Yeah, he did. His phone's overheating. Or he's moving too fast. Uh, hey, Charles. I sure am. I don't see Charles. How's it going? Don, how's it going, buddy? Woohoo! Let me take this thing off. All right, we'll see. Here we go. What is it? A dragon? It's a wing. It's a oh. wing. No, it turned out good. That's all, all there. Damn near. Nice. All the little tiny specks of the like all the uh, little lines inside there. I mean, it's all the every bit of it's there, bro. It, it came out really even the eye. I mean, it turned out really stinking good. Nice. Can you make two of them? No, please. <laughs> um, uh -huh. So, close pan that's extra, extra red. Hello, PA Patriot Prospecting. How you doing, brother? Hey, PA. Chris Levine's back. Hello. I bet he's from Pennsylvania. Yeah. Hey. Hello, Don. What's the extra ad, man? All right. Turned out extra ad. Broke six K coin. Nice. That's that one you didn't have to do much cleanup on, ain't it? Yeah. A little Coke bottle. Unfortunately. Well, at least you ain't from Massachusetts. And tiny, tiny foot. Mm hmm. Yeah. How are you? Those all cleaned up. Got the dolphin. I'll be able to get that cleaned up uh, for Kelly in the morning, Todd. So I'll be able to get that shipped out. So I'm doing all my shipping tomorrow. Nice. Getting everything, getting everything out of here. <clears throat> Sweet. I got called back into work on the 20th. I thought it was the 30th, but I go back to work on the 20th now. So 
Damn. Mm -hmm. That's extra rad. Get all the stuff cleaned up, right, y'all? Whoa, whoa! Get over here, there we go. Take all this stuff. A little silver in the vent. Get those out. Nice, PA. Bam. Hope everything goes good for you. What's going on? What's going oh, on? Oh, good, buddy. That's awesome. Hell, it goes really good for you. He's been out of work for a little while. Yeah, he got a call about some work today. Oh, good. Heck yeah, that's good. Yeah. You guys ready for a funny sticker? Oh, my God. My hand just touched that piece of silver. <laughs> Oh man, that was fun. <laughs> uh -huh. This one's still hot. Hello, Charles. Charles the Trey. Yeah, Charles, I'm making a bracelet for the auction for sure this week for this weekend. So whoever whoever wins that lot, they gotta email me and let me know what size their wrist is or who whatever size I'm making it for. So it is, it is a foxtail bracelet, so it's going to look like this one right here. That's the design we'll be, give, we'll be making for the St. Jude's auction this weekend. Let me get myself off this big screen and share the love, huh? You're going to travel to Maryland for a couple of months. Thanks for what, little brother? Oh, sit down. I'm standing up for almost two hours. <sighs> nice. <laughs> Gotta love the sticker right there. I know it's ready. We're gonna bring it up close. Really, man. It should be illegal. <laughs> Sticker makes me think of laugh. No, I'm not going to pick it up, see if it's cooled off yet. Okay. Yeah, it's cooled off. I mean, it'll burn you if you hold on to it, but it's not going to burn you by just by the touch. You'd have to hold on for it for a little bit. Yeah, it'll, it'll get you still. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, Todd, I'm glad that thing came out, man. That's, that's looking awesome. Hell yeah. Looked pretty good. Can't wait to see it in person. How much cleanup on it? Not much, right? Well, the, yeah, the tail's got a lot of cleanup on it, but that's all right. Yeah. yeah. I, I made it thick right there so because how thin it was, so it pour in there, you know what I'm saying? So I try to keep all the detail on the whole entire right. thing. So right. back there's the only spot that's actually really solid flat. So I mean, I have some filing down. I'll, I'll probably just use a Dremel on it. And I can see the whole the whole entire spot where it goes, you can see, but. Nice. There's a lot. There's a lot of a lot of extra silver there, which is fine. I'd rather have a little extra than not have enough. So I'll be able to do a little cleanup on it that way. But yeah, it should okay. come out. Should stick and come out just fine. I got a little filing to do on the inside where the wing separates from the body, right there. But 
I can just take the jeweler saw and knock that out. That's a little small spot. A lot to go through. It is. Let me get my loop, see what I can see on here. Oh, no, see, this is going to go just fine, Todd. Nice. Yep, I'll antique it for her, too, so. Let the darks and the, and the lows and the lights and the highs pop out, so they'll bring out really good. I'll set that right there so I don't get in the way. And Kelly's a little dolphin. Very little cleanup on that, too. Oh, Bill. Atlantic Adventures is in the house. Hey, Bill. Hey, Bill. Now the chat's in trouble. Yep. <laughs> he said, yep. <laughs> Can't trust that guy. Nah. Uh -huh. He's a pretty good troll, too. <laughs> right, Bill? He said, that's right. All right. Got that damn song stuck in my head, man. How you doing tonight, Bill? That echo in is Todd. Is it? Ah, I'm back. Ah, it's not that bad. Hello? 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 Is it back? So I'll, I'll come back. I don't hear anything, so uh, it's only when I talk. Yeah, it's only it's only happening when I talk. I don't I don't hear it when you talk though. Do you hear hear it when he talks, Bradley? Nope. I'm all right, Bill. That is wild. Can anybody else hear that? Yeah, he they hearing it in chat too. Uh, yes. I'll be back. Yes, Charles, I will, brother. I will for sure. For sure, for sure. Do, 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 do. Yep. How are y'all doing tonight out there on this wonderful Monday? Todd down. Yeah, you go. <laughs> yeah, that Todd character. Yeah, he gets like a feedback. I don't know. It's got to be his phone. He said it used to happen with Mike too, right? Though. Yeah, it's really bad. When, uh, uh, Mike's on there. What's that? Try so tired and just hanging around. Nice. <laughs> I like Be that. back. I like the basement.
Yeah, he does. I hit the button for him. What the hell's going on? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Status yeah. quo. It's not completely unacceptable, though. Mostly. Well, just mostly, but not completely. Yeah, that's uh, okay, Bill. Todd, guess it. Take a guess how much you think this this uh, thing weighs right now before cleanup. Wait a minute. Um, you you know how big the mold was, so one point six. Holy shit! That's what I'm, that's what I'm gonna charge you for now. <laughs> Fourteen point three grams. Really? That's it? Well, you tell me what it says right here. Wow, I thought it was I thought it was over an ounce. I really thought that would be over an ounce. Or at least over three quarters of an ounce anyway. Fourteen point three grams, brother. Sweet. That's, that's light. Before. And that's before cleanup, so it's going to be right around, right around eleven and a half grams by the time it's finished. Yeah, well, that's cool. Yeah, I still got a soldering ring on the inside right here too. Because I got the two posts right here. They came right. Out, they came out in silver too, which is dope. So I'll be able to use those as a my soldering point. So nice. Yep. <laughs> yeah. She's gonna like that one. I hope so. Yeah, it's not it's not heavy, so it's it's light. Let's we'll see what the right weighs. The mold weighs thirteen point one, Todd. Wow. Even though you can't really measure pewter, I guess, and well, ounce is Troy though, but that's what it weighs. Oh no, actually no, we're just in grams. Yeah, it's thirteen thirteen point two grams. Yeah, 13.1 grams. Woo! Uh, the silver okay. piece is 13, uh, 14.3, so yeah, it's going to be right around a... Actually, there's not a lot of cleanup. Well, there's a lot out here, yeah. Probably lose two grams on there, so... That's 12 grams, right. maybe. 11 and a half, 12 grams when we're done with it. That's pretty cool. Yes, sir, Steve. How you doing tonight, buddy? Making Mr. Joe Durbin a silver clothespin. Yeah. You know hey, what? Steve, what's point? We get to work right now with the original spring, the steel spring in it. Let's see, without any cleanup on it, huh? Let's see if this thing will work. Do to do. Hold on, my hands over here. Close pin. If I can hold still. Right, you have to go on the damn thing. Huh? There we go. That's okay. Now remember, this ain't no this has, this is no cleanup on it either, you guys. So check this out. All right. Thanks, Bill. That's what, I, what Bradley's working on right there. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to let you go so you can get that. you paying attention to me. I thought Todd was going to bed early. 
<laughs> yeah, I gotta get up early. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty cool. I go in bed early, past already. <laughs> yeah, I ain't eating even ten o'clock yet, so. Extra ad. Well, you would like this. PayPal censored you. <laughs> what? Hi, Cindy. She's gone. <laughs> she gone. She bailed. Yeah, little silver clothespins. These things are right. What? What about an ounce or half ounce when these things are done? Uh, they are about a half an ounce. Something like that, yeah. Uh, 0.732 right now before cleanup, so a little bit more than a half an ounce. Pretty cool, though, little clothespin, silver clothespins. EMR Coins, hello. Nice to see you. How's it going, Eric? Did a couple pours. Cleaned up a couple other pours. Like the broke, my broke 6K coin. Well, it's my broke coin that I stamped 6K and everything else. Pretty cool, though. Pretty extra ad. And we got a little miniature Coke bottle. Extra ad. Got a little tiny foot. Extra ad. Yeah. Thanks, Bill. Tonight we poured a little clothespin. Make another silver clothespin. Got to make the spring out of sterling silver, though, so. Pure silver is too soft. So we'll make the spring out of that. Then we pour this little uh, feather. I'm not sure what the hell it's for, but it's probably for Todd, so. We pour down a little dolphin. Yeah. Yeah, Victoria does got tiny feet. <laughs> Pedal covers like that. <laughs> well, I, it was a it was a fetal that I took the feet off it, so I can do an individual feet on it and everything else. But once I make this completely, then it's, it holds slab coins perfectly. And your cell phones, if you turn it on the side, pretty badass when you're done. When you're done, you're putting two feet in order in now, though, brother. Okay. You had to email me though. <laughs> oh, don't mention dolphins around Cliff. I forgot. <laughs> dolphins and tuna fish, not a good subject around Cliff. Very touchy. Very touchy. Touchy feely. Yeah. It is Monday. This is the Mondayest Monday I've ever Mondayed. Well, better than being Tuesday on a Monday. Put my phone in. <laughs> <laughs> that damn sticker kills me. <laughs> That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Yeah, the little feet are cool. The little hands are cool. Donkey. I ain't got any little hands made right now, but yeah, those little hands are really cool too. Tiny feet, tiny hands. Oh. <laughs> he wants two left feet to lay matches. <laughs> oh, he wants two rights, two rights. He does a circle. Two left don't make a right. And see, Mikey, how you doing, brother? Uh, 
Hello, Mike. Good to see you. <clears throat> hey, did you ever get your hot sauce? <laughs> Never did get back to me. Yeah, if you were gone for a month, that definitely was probably no good sitting in the mailbox. Yeah, he said he told he threw it away since you told him to. He threw it away. Yeah. No, that's I think you should have tried it. It probably would have been just like vinegar. No. I, I wouldn't chance it. <clears throat> no, that thing'll make you sicker than tight. Yeah, he wasn't messing around with that. Good idea. Yeah. Real good I'm just idea. glad he didn't. I don't need somebody to get sick. That'd be awful. Yes, it would. Now, if I if I would if I did fermented sauces, that would have been fine. You know, you know what I'm saying. He burned an extra hole in his rear. Todd Miller, me, we cause. What? What? I don't know. But this did something bad to Steve. He bombed an extra hole. <laughs> he says he can send you some shipping, Todd, if you need some shipping. Mr. Mikey did. Oh, his hot sauce? I think we lost Todd. He probably probably tried to turn on his video. Huh? Are you, am I there or what? Am I here? Can you hear me? Yeah, can you hear us? Yeah, now I can. What the hell happened? I don't know, but Mikey's saying he'll, he'll, he'll send you some shipping if you need some shipping. Yeah, because I, I spent, I think, what, 15 bucks or something like that? No, it was more than that. Oh, yeah. I don't even remember how much it was. It was right around 15 bucks, I think. 13 bucks. Man, that wind. Hope we don't lose power tonight. I hate the wind, man. I got big ears, that's why. And I, and I live out here in the desert. That sand blowing everywhere, man, that's like a 10 Q-tip night for me. I gotta turn over the, I gotta turn over the toilet plunger, but rubber bands and paper towels on the end of it, get all up inside there. <laughs> Whoa, easy little brother. You know, little brother, there's times for you to concur and there's times not for you to concur. You know what I'm saying? And like one of those times that could be right now. Acceptable. It is unacceptable. <laughs> I do get free satellite, though. He ain't lying about that. If it was Thursday, it wouldn't be unacceptable. <laughs> no, no, Thursday you, you get, yeah, you get something. You get something special on Thursdays. Yeah, that's HBO. <sighs> Only ten board folks left. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Ten people's extra ad. 
You didn't get that memo? Or you, you did now. Strike one. Let me pull over this chat a little bit. I'm going to pull the chat over. Oh, man. And we got 24 people uh, displaced and 14 kids. To, uh, excuse me, 43 people and 14 kids displaced today because uh, of three different house fires here in Las Vegas. That's horrible. Crazy. Um, yeah, man, it sucks. Not a good day for the flipping people that lost their homes today in fire, man. That's no good. Uh, three different instances. It's not good at all. We're actually, Neil, our old, our old apartment's actually caught on fire today. Uh, on Rainbow, Washington, and across the street from Ken's house. They caught on fire this morning. Uh, the, actually, both places we live caught on fire. Baby Ghetto caught on Lake Vita Jones. Baby Ghetto caught on fire today. Uh, yeah, the BGs caught on fire. Rainbow, Washington, Wildflower caught on fire today. And then the house over up in uh, North Jones and uh, like Aliente or something caught on fire today. But yeah, both places we lived had caught on fire today. <laughs> The, the Bee Gees, we call that the Baby Ghetto, and then Wild Wildflower on the corner of Washington and, uh, and Rainbow caught off uh, caught off fire today. The both places we lived at, yeah, forty three people. I'm not laughing because of that. I'm just saying I'm more laughing because it's kind of funny that we lived there before. And their places are bad, man. You think that because back in the '70s when they were built in the early '80s, there wasn't fire codes here, so there wasn't no uh, no sprinklers uh, uh, in, in force. So. Now everything is enforced. Even all the brand new homes, all the new codes, they have to have uh, fire. They're all have fire systems built into them here in Las Vegas. So, ever since that Bally's fire in the '80s, that's that's changed the whole thing across the whole country when it comes to fire sprinkler systems here. Ah, Vegas ain't. Just a couple. Oh, Rally's burning. Yeah. <laughs> the freaking amateur hour here. Yeah. And see, Mikey, you're gonna be back in you're back in town for good now, or it, 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 it'll take me a, a few days to try to find somebody to give me a ride to the post office to send another bottle out to you. Plus, I gotta get it ready and. Takes me takes me a few days to, to get everything packaged up. I'm not sure how much shipping it was. I can't remember how much it was. Did you hear me? Now I can. All right, nice. All right, that was Miss Trissy calling saying she's off work now. Yes, sir, Mikey. The old MGM Grand. Yes, sir. What you making, Cliff? You almost done? Uh, I'm done for tonight. Well, that's good, I guess. You guys tired or what? What's going on? We got 14 extra rad people up here, though. Hey, Mike, did you get my any of my emails? Because I, I, I believe I sent you my phone number. Take your time. We had not back out in the month. Now where are you going, Mike? Lord mercy. You just got home. He's already going back. Right. Home. Right. <laughs> you must have had a hell of a trip. Wow, Neil, really? He says he'll check, Todd. Please send it again. All right, let me let, let me get a bottle ready. And uh, like I said, I I gotta depend on a ride, so the, a person. So, and I'm busy all day tomorrow. I got doctor's appointments tomorrow. So, there'll be a few days before I can get it out. 
but I'll get out as soon as I can to you. Oh, your work requires a lot of travel? Okay. But did, did, is he getting my emails, though? Is Mike getting my emails? Let me ask him real quick for you. Hey, Mike. <laughs> Todd would like to know if you're getting any of his emails. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, I didn't get any, any responses back from him. That's why. He was, dig he was digging. Well, I know that. I know he's a busy person. I just... Measles outbreak? What the hell? 17 states got measles? Oh. How do you, you get the measles anymore? I haven't heard that in like 40 years. Yeah, I remember had on my tea too. My, I'm missing this one, right there, and that one right there. <laughs> mm -hmm. I remember when you were skinny. That was 79. Oh, wait, that was when he was born. What you making, Cliff? Can't Nothing wrong. All I see is all I see is a sticker with big ears. Big ears. You know, I got his cousin right here. Cargo organ. You okay, Todd? Or are you emailing Mike? No, I'm here. Why? What's going on? Oh, no. You must. You falling asleep? Mm. Well, this. I'm not falling. This ten o'clock. Your guys' time. Ten after ten. Your guys' time. If you guys want to go, we can. I'll, I'll send uh, Mike an email tomorrow when I get back from the doctor's office. Probably be in the, in the afternoon. Okay. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Those ears right there are sexy. Keep those things clean. That's right. He sent you a text, Todd. Uh, Mikey did. All right. Yeah, I can't. Can't look at it right now. Well, no, you'll kick yourself out. You can't even. You can't even yeah, I know. I, will. I, I don't want to push any buttons. Nope. Well, All right, Mike. Go, Thanks, brother. brother. All right, little brother. You have a great night. Tell the family I say hello. And I'll see you guys shortly. Night, Neil. Text in the bell, Bradley. <laughs> that was a secret. Well, Lee, that was a secret, buddy. Uh, you out here too, Steve? Everybody's out here, I guess. With even Brian says later, Steve says later. Yeah. All right, we'll get out of here, I guess. Yeah. I'm going right. to start an early stream tomorrow about 
what about nine o'clock, eight, eight o'clock my time. So that's eleven o'clock on the East Coast. So yeah, I'll be <laughs> in the doctor's <laughs> office. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, right. You're gonna you're gonna get a text message here real shortly. <laughs> yeah. Good night, everybody. Nice, Siren. Night, everyone. Neil, Steve. Neil, Siren. Bye, Siren. Woo. Brian. Bye, Steve. Mikey. Bye, everybody else is here. Y'all, thanks for coming. We appreciate it. We'll see y'all tomorrow. We gone. Oh. I post tomorrow uh -huh, about big ears. Uh-huh.